Hello and welcome to this week's Security Roundup. We are covering some of the important topics, starting from the NISD strategies on securing the supply chain and sharing some highlights on the IoT security from Accenture. Let's dive in. NISD is offering strategies to help businesses secure their cyber supply chains. Reducing the cybersecurity risk to one of the most vulnerable aspects of commerce, global supply chains, is the goal of the new publication by the National Institute of Standards and Technology, NIST, whose computer security experts have distilled a set of effective risk management techniques into a draft guide for businesses. A 2013 attack by the Dragonfly Group targeted companies with industrial control systems such as those distributing energy within the United States. This attack infected companies in critical industries with malware. Symantec's 2019 Internet Security Threat Report found supply chain attacks increased by 78% in 2018. Key practices in cyber supply chain risk management provides a risk of strategies to help businesses address the cybersecurity issues posed by modern information and communication technology products, which are commonly built using components and services supplied by third-party organizations. The composed nature of these devices and systems makes them difficult to secure effectively against malware and other threats, placing manufacturers, service providers, and end users at risk. The key practices here advised are integrating cyber supply chain risk management across the organization, establishing a formal program, knowing and managing critical suppliers, understanding the supply chain, closely collaborating with the key suppliers, including key suppliers in resilience and improvement activities, assessing and monitoring throughout the supply relationship, and planning for a full cycle. You can read all about it at www.nist.gov. Reinventing the internet to secure the digital economy. A survey report from Accenture clearly states that 79% of the respondents reported that their organizations are adopting new and emerging technologies faster than they can address related security issues. CEOs looking to innovate confidently and safely should consider making internet security a driving force in their business model. By doing so, they'll be able to leverage their unique vantage point and gain greater insight into where and why the internet has grown fragile. While some of the issues are due to the constantly evolving digital landscape, other challenges are embedded in the internet's infrastructure. To secure the digital economy, executives will need to address the following issues. 1. Inherent flaws. The internet wasn't created with connectivity in mind. It was developed to enable anonymity, data sharing and redundancy, all of which require trust. 2. Identity and data veracity. There's a growing phenomenon of content over context. Internet users are less able to discover the origin and validity of material. 3. The IoT effect. While IoT equipment offers many opportunities, it also increases businesses' vulnerabilities to hacks and data breaches. And finally, 4. Digital fragmentation. Increased fragmentation, fueled in part by security concerns, could itself stunt future global economic growth. Intelligent Cybersecurity, Automation and Orchestration by NTT While cloud-based security, machine learning, and the move from zero trust to digital trust are common threads from last year, there has been a fundamental shift in how security is being acquired. Automation and orchestration are the watchwords for 2020. Security Orchestration, Automation, and Responses, SOAR, will be the hottest area in cybersecurity in the year to come. Here are some of the problems and their solutions NTT suggests. 1. Attacks happen at machine speed and need machine speed responses. The problem? 75% of threats detected in SOC are by supervised machine learning and threat intelligence. And the solution? Embed intelligence into infrastructure and applications. Use algorithms to recognize patterns, identify anomalies, and automatically orchestrate security controls. 2. Security moves to the cloud. Moving to the cloud, you need to know the risk. What's the problem? Attacks on critical infrastructure are one of the top five issues facing businesses today. So the solution being, test your security posture across all types of infrastructure and work with a security vendor that can help you manage security from the data center to the edge. Three, applications are the new attack vectors. What's the problem? Application-specific and web application attacks accounted for over 32% of hostile traffic, making them the top category of hostile activity. And the solution? Run regular hygiene checks. Evaluate the security hygiene of applications regularly and apply the necessary patches. 
These are the updates for you from the world of digital security. Thank you for joining us for this week's Security Roundup. We look forward to meeting you next week at the same place.